When I was 18, I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis, also known as MS. I uh, fractured my knee in five places, ice skiing. Lost my legs in Afghanistan in 2009 after standing on an IED. I was born with um, cardio and congenital myopathy. My disability is spina bifida from birth. I think what sledge hockey gives to the individual is a sense of achievement and being part of a team gives you a sense of belonging, something that you can attach to. The Cardiff Sledge Hockey Club was set up in 1996. Andy McNulty approached the ice rink in the centre of town about setting up a sledge hockey team. So they were given six, six weeks ice time to see if they could get it up and running. And almost like um, one of those movies where, you know, everything sort of comes together at the last minute. It was literally the last session that about half a dozen people turned up and um, from that they were able to form the Cardiff Huskies. The club just grew from strength to strength. In 2001, the, the British League was set up. And uh, in 2003, Cardiff Huskies won the league. Unfortunately, in 2006, the club closed down. I think it was really important for us to re-establish the team because it was one of the strongest teams in the UK at the time. For me, it was very important because it gave me something to do, to be perfectly honest. I just found the love for the sport, even though it's not the usual ice hockey that I used to play. In my eyes, it's exactly the same, even though you're sat in a sledge. But anything just to get back on the ice is just a bonus for me, and I love doing what I do. It means a lot to me, really. It just uh, gives me an opportunity to play as part of a team, whereas in other team sports, like football and that, obviously I can't play, because I can't really run or take a bash to the side. In 2013, we rejoined the league. We've been second in the league two years running now, so um, we would like clearly to improve on that and we would like to win the league. We'd like to think we play hard and we work hard. The bantering up we have on our away games, the social side of it, it's really good fun. It's got myself back, back into a team, just like uh, it was in the military. I'm working for people and they're working for me. Um, and it's great fitness, it uh, keeps me occupied keeps me mindset on something to do for the rest of the week.